Hello everyone, it's Brandy Janae. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. In today's video, I'm going to be doing my community savings challenges and battle of the boxes. So if you're interested in seeing how any of that goes, please be sure to stay tuned. Okay, so we're going to start with our sinking funds first hair. <laughs> Let's see how much money we have. 10, 20, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, <clears throat> 61, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. If you hear anything funny, it's because I am dealing with a sinus infection right now Ugh, i know i'm on the antibiotics but you know it's gonna take a while to fully kick in i feel like i might be behind on this so i'm going to scratch two circles today oh no just kidding <laughs> Woo, seven dollars just kidding we're gonna just do this one because I have so many boxes and I really want to get through all of them. So five, six, seven. Yeah, I have a lot of boxes and I want to get through each of them. Okay, and this challenge here is from Ellie on Earth. I don't know if I said that or not, but it is a community challenge that she sends out to people so if you're interested in that definitely go check her out i will have her linked in the description box and that just reminded me i forgot to read the quote for today it says lord make me an instrument of thy peace where there is hatred let me sow love by francis of i think that's a sissy i love that i love that i definitely always want to be a place of peace and definitely would rather sow love than hatred for sure. So I love that. All right. And then here we have our $18 for this challenge. This is a community challenge by Donna over at Donna by Power, Donna Powered by Creativity. Whoa, slow down. Um, I have my dice tower here basically if you follow along with them there's three days a week they show the videos where a person stuffs six dollars each time because i am doing this on my own i take the 18 dollars and just stuff it once a week so here we go we have two which is holidays five which is abundance Five again, very good. Three, debt. Two, holiday. Three, debt. Six is O oh, poop. <laughs> Three again is debt. And last but not least, three again. We have debt. All right, so nothing went in one, which is give generously. That's okay. And the holidays, we are adding $4. And this will be in here until we get to December. I think it's December 7th or December 8th. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. That's going in debt. So this will be something else that I'm using to work towards my $5,000 savings goal. So I'm excited about that. Nothing in self-care. $4 is going into abundance. And $2 is going into O poop. All right. And that is it for this portion. Now, time to get ready for the battle of the boxes. Let me move this over, scoot this back. I feel like my camera shifted again. Okay. All right. I have my binders boxes here. Here are the cards for all of them. And <clears throat> I think that's all I need. I am going to 
replace this money though with my oh i need these two i don't have enough room on this table i wish my table was like a little bit deeper it's very long but it's you know narrow if that makes sense but i do have my prop money which is what i am going to be using for all of my uh challenges so let's see how much we have left 10 20 30 so actually you know what let's just one two three five ten fifteen twenty twenty five Just gonna kind of replace it and then if we need change we can do that i have these from Mari over at budgets and chaos and this is just money from amazon five ten fifteen twenty twenty five there we go and then let's see one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. So, one, oops, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, and thirteen. Okay. There we go. So we'll just use the same denominations that we have. <clears throat> and I'm going to scoot this back one and put the prop money here. Okay. All right. So we are going to do the, we have eight boxes. So I'm going to use the coffee box, just the box part, and leave the coffee challenges as they are because I have so many, um, why did I put this in here? Oh, that's for the coffee. Okay. Yeah. So because I have so many of the coffee box challenges left, I decided to go ahead and add this to my boxes. So you will be seeing this binder twice. So this is the coffee binder. Then I have my spooky binder, which is new. I'm adding this now. I got this one from GB over at Income Babes. Super excited about this. So this one is new. Coffee box, I'm sorry, I forgot to say, is from Maria over at She's Got It. I did switch the binders out into the binders that I just got in. So that's why it's in a different one. Then we have our chocolate box. And this is from A for Alicia or Saving with Alicia. And we have the Christmas box, which is also from GB over at Income Babes. So many boxes. <laughs> we have the donut box, which is from my Etsy shop. We have, uh, which one is this? We have the monthly box, and this is from I Will Always Save. Yes, I Will Always Save. So it's like a calendar box. And we have Stitches for Riches. This is the newest savings challenge in my Etsy shop. And then I also added this Juice Detox Challenge from Maria over at She's Got It. So I added both of these and I'm going to just use these cards in the back as a roll and save. So that's kind of like a, you know, health box. And then the newest, another new one is at the mall and this is by prop budgets i have been waiting so long for her to release the second floor she finally did so i'm gonna go ahead and i did add this one to my roster so now i have a total of eight let me move this so that all of my boxes can fit oh my gosh you guys i just dropped the whole thing oh. It's going to take me all night to put that back together. Oh, my gosh. Okay. Wow. I can't believe I just did that. I mean, I can, but. <laughs> oh, I need a drink of water after that. Mm, mm, mm. You guys, I cannot believe I just dropped. I mean, I like I said, I can't believe it, but I just. Oh, I'm so sad right now. 
it's literally gonna take me forever to get that put back together okay so i have my boxes spooky is in number one monthly number two stitch is number three christmas is four chocolate is five coffee is six mail is seven donut is eight i do have a 10 sided die so if i get a nine or a 10 i'm gonna just make that a choose your own kind of thing but as usual we are going to go through every box once first and then we will roll to see which one we get so first card and i got the idea of numbering everything from hot beauty budgets <laughs> so i went on a numbering spree yesterday so this one is seven dollars i'm so having a little bit of a hard time breathing because i'm still kind of breathing through my nose so if you hear me struggling that's why five six seven i'm sorry i'm not really able to breathe through my nose is what i really meant so seven prop dollars goes in there and seven real dollars goes in here because I can't really put, if I played this individual, like by itself, then I would put the, all the real money in here and then play with the prop money. But since I'm doing both at the same time, that's why that's happening. Monthly, is it necessary? No, but at some point I may decide to play one of these again without the rest of them. <laughs> so this way it'll keep me, it'll keep me in line. So that's the only reason why I'm doing it with the prop money. Cause one day I may decide to, you know, play one just instead of doing battle of boxes one day one sunday i might just decide to just literally do the calendar box and just not do any of the other ones so that's why i left it this way all right so for the calendar box this card is here oh man i'm assuming this is in the summertime okay so this is in august mm, mm, mm. roll a dice oh man and triple it gosh 15 sheesh okay <laughs> 15 oh man okay so put that in there this box is no joke my friends oh i forgot this is the marker that was broken 15 gosh okay all right so there's that one and then stitches for riches this also has cards and this is oh anesthesia wearing off so this is just a bonus one and ten dollars <laughs> i love that for me i do except for i don't <laughs> so this is just a bonus one so there's really nowhere to uh put the prop bill so we're just gonna not we're just gonna just put the real money in there and we're gonna and that's gonna be that okay christmas i feel like i'm almost out of money already Christmas is here. This is a cookie charm. Let's see where that is. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know where this is. Cookie charm. I don't see it unless it's because like I mean the pictures aren't the same so yeah this Christmas tree and these Christmas trees are not the same so we're gonna just pretend like it's this one I don't know if this is the one it's supposed to be but it says eight dollars so five 
six, seven, eight. So we're just gonna go with that. Five, six, seven, eight. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. That looks great though. And then we're also going to mark off one of these for a dollar on our bingo board. Because we're still trying to get bingo. And I don't know why I already have six dollars in here since I only have three of these marked off, but what if? <laughs> oh. No, five dollars in here when I have three marked off. I don't know. Okay. All right, Christmas is done. So we're gonna put that card back. This one goes up front along with this. And that's the end of that. All right, chocolate is oh man the chocolate box is so scary i picked up two. Oh man pralines too sweet at two dollars oh my gosh that one is eight okay so this one gets ten yeah i'm almost out of money And at the end of the month, this time, I am going to empty out all of these. I'm not going to stop playing them, but I am going to empty them all out because, again, I'm not really a fan of my money just sitting here. <laughs> so we're going to empty this out so that this money can start moving around to where it needs to be because these challenges are all going to take a while because there's lots of cards. All right, chocolate box. Let's see, chocolate is here. Come on. All right, chocolate mix is... This is not the chocolate box. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is the coffee box. <laughs> I was like, what? Okay, Kenya. Uh, J, K for Kenya. This is $8. I do have real money in this one, so we're going to leave it alone. Five, six, seven, eight. Because I don't want to mess this up. All right. And I may switch this. I don't know. I might put the coffee box. I think I am going to put the coffee box in a separate challenge because Maria did make an extension for this. So I think the coffee box is going to go in a separate binder. And then I put the actual coffee challenges in another binder. Because as you can see, this binder is thick. Thick like me. All right. Then we have the mall. And the mall challenge has this super cute little like shopping cart. And normally you would roll a dice to see how many cards. First, you have, okay, step one. First, you have to roll the dice to see <laughs> which store you're going to shop at. I totally forgot. So this one is very, I'm not going to do that. This is what I'm going to do. These are the cards for the different stores. So I'm going to pick a card. I am the worst shuffler ever. Okay. I am going to pick a card. And we are going to woo the ele electronic store, which is on the first floor. So I'm going to put this back up. And then we'll mix that one back in. Um, electronics store. These are not in any 
type of order. Okay, so normally what I was going to say is you would pick, you would roll to see how many cards you're going to do. You know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. If we don't get to the donut box, then we just don't get to it. All right. Oh my gosh. <laughs> One, uh, two, three, four, five, and six. Oh my goodness. And then, nope, that's not that. Then I have to get a tax card to see how much we're paying in taxes. Six dollars! Ah! I know I'm gonna have an IOU, guys. I know I'm gonna have an IOU this time. All right, now let's roll again because if we get an even number, then we can get a sales card. And then if we don't, then we don't. One, not even, no sales card. Okay. Woo! Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh. One, four, seven, nine. 12, 13, 14, and six is $20 at the electronic store. Oh man, I need another sip of water. Mm, mm, mm. First time out the gate, $20. Whew, electronic store. Oh man, $20. $20. Ah! <laughs> okay. So then this can go here. Mm, mm, mm. And then whew, this can go back in here. $20. Y'all see how long it's taking me to figure out how much money I got left. All right, and then this will go in here because we've already done it. So I'm flipping it around so we don't do it again. Actually, I probably just end up mixing it back together, but whatever. Okay, let's see what we got. Oh God, not even close. Five, oh my gosh. Six, seven, eight, nine. Bruh. This feels like way more than nine. How did I mess this up? Y'all, how did I mess this up? <laughs> I don't know how I messed this up. Oh, man. I didn't put... Oh, I didn't put prop money in the coffee box. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, I didn't put prop money in the coffee box. I forgot. And I didn't put prop money in... Was it Christmas? One of those one, or no, whatever one it was that I got the $10 that goes in a random spot. Oh, I think it was the stitches box. Okay, so there is that nine. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I owe this one. How much was that? How much did I say I had? Nine? No, I can't remember. Yes, nine. Okay, so I owe this 11. Oh my gosh. Ah, $11. So here is one of my super cute IOU magnets. Mm, mm, mm. Okay, so $11. Oh man, and this is laminated so that you can reuse them and I'm gonna just clip that there is that dry yes and that's it guys we're out of money so donut box didn't get didn't get chosen today I knew I should have just picked one card I knew it I knew it that's okay 
anyway you guys <laughs> that is the end of this video i hope that you enjoyed it if you did please be sure to give it a thumbs up also do not forget to check the description box so you can see all of the challenges that i have and go get you some because savings challenges are so much fun you guys are amazing be safe be kind or be quiet and be well and i'll catch you in the next one